We'll make it spicy. Pad Thai. Supposed to take 30 minutes. We gave ourselves 60 minutes. Oh, oh we're out of peanuts. Where are you going? You're lost. One, two, three, four. Looking goopy. Poor. Mech. Poor. Mech. Poor. Mech. And cool for 20 minutes. Tastes like cheesecake. Woo! Took us 21 minutes. Good one, good one. And cost 20 bucks. Right. Ready, set, go. Cut the ball. Family. Crunchy, fresh. Very crunchy. Yeah. That's one. Two. Three. Four. Six. Six. And twenty-one. Twenty. Good sandwich. We're making a tiny salad for pesto. What's up, Doc? Pesto, come on! You gotta eat to get big and strong! He's looking for more. He's looking for more. Oh, oh my god, god, what a shot! What a <laughs> shot! Oh, yeah. Want to know the history of lollipops? Started with the caveman poking some beehive. And having honey on a stick. Ooga booga. That's good. Then in Egypt, they collected nuts and seeds, got them, mixed it with honey, and had it on a stick. King Tut's gotta hear about this. Next, what? George Smith was making hard candy with a popsicle. He gave it to its kids and thought, wow, I should make hard candy on a stick. Finally, the modern lollipop, sugar, water, corn syrup to 300 degrees, mixing in flavor and dye. Adding in the sticks, pour it into the mold, and letting it cool. Did you know lollipops were named after a racehorse? Make sure you check out the History Channel's TikTok. It's home for curious minds. You want shrimp cookie under one condition. If you give me my swamp back. Lord Farquaad could never. Ooh, baby. That sauce is perfection. The Big Mac Slider. A perfect bite-sized meal. Start by dicing an onion. Cook the onions till golden brown. Then add one pound of ground beef. Chop it up and brown. For the secret sauce, mayo, relish, yellow mustard, paprika, onion powder, and garlic powder. Mm, it smells great. Onions, beef, cheese, secret sauce, pickles, cover with tin foil, and bake at 350 for 15 minutes. Top with melted butter and sesame seeds, and bake for another five minutes. Sorry, baby. Can't have any. We're making the green mold. Mm -hmm. This is my mom's recipe on a ratty old index card. And it even has the secret recipe on the back. <laughs> my mom didn't smack the green mold. 
One big box of lime jello. Two packages of gelatin. One and two third cups of hot water. Sorry about that. Looks like it came out of Chernobyl. Cup of sour cream. Maybe not the best idea. Take out half a cup of juice. Grab our mold. Top and cool. Ta-da! So pretty. Reminds me of my childhood. And heat to 270. White truffle salt. Top with chives. Crunchy and delicious. Level one, ramen. So basic. Yum, 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 yum. Level two. Oh, believe it. Here's the secret. One egg. Getting there. Level three. Wow. Bonus egg. Gently place in the eggs. Uh, can I one more? And finally, the noodles. Mmm, that is really good. Give me back my pork belly. You want squeak game cookies? I'm not doing it. Of course I beat the squid game. Mmm, -mm, pretty good. Sauce it up. Oh, my God. You do want to take any metal objects out. Superb. Looking good. Oh, it looks perfect. And it even looks good from the back. If you never had a bacon, egg, and cheese, do me a favor and immediately stop following both of us. The more butter, the better. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Pull it over. Ooh, it looks perfect. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah.
Oh dear, that's good. Diwali cookies. Oh my god, he on X Games mode. Next <laughs> faster, Linja. Try my best. Bam. Just kidding about before, Linja. Mix it up. Get in there, little rascal. Slice it. Top with rose petals. Mmm. You want a pizza cookie? Okay. Muffy. Too thick for the blade. Linda, use my good hand. Linda, give me my hook back. No. The mega cookie. Damn. Icing. Honeycomb candy. It's gonna get pretty exciting here. Woo! Look at it grow! Let it cool. Woo! Woo! Going to plan B now. Plan C. Delicious. These cookie monster cookies are the most insane cookies you'll ever Let's make. see if it's bustling or not. Make friggin faster, Linda. Sorry. Beat up the cookie monster. Collect his tears. Ah. Nice cup. Sorry about before, Linda. Bang, baby. Deep fry this watch? This was a gift from Ed Sheeran? No, I think we should. Give me that! Stop! No! I can't believe we're doing this. This is insane. Whoa! This is insane. You have any lemon and cocktail sauce? Absolutely. I can't believe we did this. I can't even buy into it. This is disgusting. Here, spit it up. It still works. That's a good watch. It can withstand frying. We're making shakshuka. If it doesn't bust, I don't want it. Garlic, mint with Tabasco. Onion, dice it. Mmm, cayenne, cumin, pepper, salt, green Tabasco. I'm in the vortex. Crumble, crumble, crumble. There it is. Mm. The Tabasco really brings out the flavor. It. That was stupid. I hope it's not gonna be block ice. Looks like a big lifesaver. Brain freeze! I really like the consistency. With the right flavor, it would be a really neat snack. Yummy. These are really good fried.
butter, a lemon juice. Don't say it. I smoke caviar. Spaghetti, caviar, lemon zest. Voila. The angels are singing. Uh, Open our high sense fridge, grab our fruit, wash, peel, chop, and cool. Ah! Melt down our chocolate, then temper. All this mixing has me so parched. <sighs> Refreshing. Dip and cover the fruit, then cool in the freezer for 10 minutes. The chocolates are ready. Thanks for all the help, fridge. Kiwi Tangulu on the grill. Why are you running? Now just stab them. Add your ice and the water. Twist the sink. Sugar, water. Heat to 250. This is taking forever. That's better. Getting to 240. Let's go. Mmm. Another tough day. I don't drink coffee, but I do dip my Air Force One. Coffee in. shoes. Let's see if they're styling or whining. These are fresh. Wrap in the shoe and let them sit for two hours. Final product. I feel it. I feel it coming in, coming in. Go. Walking on my You're gonna be stunting at bingo. Certified styling. Really good job. What? Oh, you want to give me a trouble? Yeah. Avoid doing that. Excellent. Sheesh. Delicioso. Here's the day, the Tabasco way. We start by testing the peppers. Oh, that is spicy. Head to the mash warehouse where all the peppers are aged. Ooh. Now we're trying the scorpion mash. Oh, it's spicy. <laughs> <laughs> then they suck up all the mash and mix it with vinegar. All these are filled with hot sauce. We head to the bottling facility and they get filled, capped, quality checked, sealed, packed, and shipped. Next, I tried the sriracha ice cream. It's not my favorite. Hopped on an airboat and saw some gators and birds. It was really awesome. I ended the day with Guga's legendary steaks. That's incredible. Mm-hmm. We're making a two foot tall chocolate rabbit. You put a little white chocolate in it. Close that. And now you have something that you can write with. Here, that's going to be, is, is um, what you call that? Huh? You're doing it. It's working, yes! The nose, it's like a big triangle. We're going to put it into the cold room over there. Okay. You can see the chocolate is hard. And then we're going to spray cocoa butter on top of it. Why do you spray it with cocoa butter? To make it shiny. So that's the first one. Two. Four times will be six pounds of chocolate. I'm going to pour the chocolate inside the rabbit here. Hopla, hold it. We're going to start vibrating everything here. Like that. Okay, remove the top. Wow! He didn't have his pedicure. He has yeah, his manicure, not okay. his pedicure. But he brushes his teeth. Yeah. I mean, look at those teeth. You know, they are really nice. I have 60 minutes to make this meal. Oh, oh. Total cook time, 20 minutes. Or so it says. Chopping the onion. Composting is great for the environment. You better be doing it. Onions, check. Galleons coming in. They're crunchy. I was going to use these, but then I found these. I thought this would save time. Blinja. Need a big 
pan. Use it what's handy. Keep some for the dogs later. The pressure's getting to me. I don't know how they can do this in 20 minutes. With the prepping and the cooking, the pan's heavy and it's hot. I'm weak and I'm lazy. We're reusing the same pan so I gotta drain off the fat. Meat back in. Sometimes you gotta measure with your heart. Oh, we're 20 minutes in. I still don't see how you can make this in 20 minutes. My poison. I'm drinking a matcha latte. Very healthy. Without the sugar. <laughs> I might have run out of Oh, you gotta go get another one. You came. Back in business. Sayonara. Garlic, ginger, soy sauce. Soy cream sauce. Woo. You want that soy sauce umami. And then we cook until it's wilted. Maybe we'll done, be done in 35 minutes. Ooh, 30 minutes in. Not bad, not good. Más o menos. Wilted, not wilted. Okay. Finally, the scallions. And stop! 36 minutes. That's a pretty quick meal. But not 20 minutes. Let's see how it tastes. Good crunch. Better than it, I thought it would be. And as promised, okay, everybody sit, sit. He's sitting. <laughs> that good, babies? Good. I never saw him squat and stand like this. I'm definitely a garlic girl. Shrimp fried rice. Yum, 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 yum. Take off the tail and clean the guts. I hate this part. Season with garlic powder and pink Himalayan salt. Cook till it matches my shirt. Add the onions and veggies. Slap around the veggies. Little nervous. Slap the fried rice around. Finally, add the shrimp. Voila. You always got to have the pocket yum, yum sauce. That yum yum sauce just complete. Is this the best chip dip? Two cans of corn. Half a red onion. Diced. Mighty fine job. Two bell peppers. Slice the scallions. Grab your tomatoes and chop them up small. Jalapeno. Take out the seeds and dice it. Beans. I need a break after that. That's better. I would add more beans. We've all seen this video. Let's see if it's busting or not. That's busting, busting. I'm making my favorite Pokemon a meal. I choose you, my champ. Charizard, use flamethrower! Mm -hmm. Squirtle, use water gun! Squirtle! We got you! Linja, close yeah. combat! Oh, I'll get you back right here. Linja, you treat all your Pokemon the best! Thank you! Get in the cage! I asked you what cookies you wanted, and this is what you said. Gummy bears, Sour Patch Kids, nerds! Didn't go as planned. The Sour Patch one? It's very nice. A little sour. Six, one out of ten. The Nerds one? Crunchy. Not so tasty. Three out of ten. The Gummy Bear one? Not looking so hot. Group.
chewy. 3.6 out of 10. Doesn't look as good as the Nerds one, but tastes a little bit better. This is Barry, the basil plant. Say hello, Barry. Here. We're gonna kill him. Hey, bozo. I'll get you back. Bonita. Check out these nuts. Daddy. Parmesan! The perfect pesto. Thanks for the basil berry. Burrito? Cookies! Give me that cookie, Grandma! <laughs> oh. <laughs> ah. Time to cool. Nice! Lord have mercy! At least not be done. <laughs> Superb. <gasps> Parsley scallions. <gasps> it's very tasty. Looks so sad, but tastes so good. This is how you improve your coffee. If you're out here using regular, regular ice, take your cup, throw it off the deck, look yourself in the mirror, and grow up. Fancy, legit ice cubes, a little French press coffee, half froth, half whipped cream, and top with cinnamon. Look how pretty it is. Mm. I went to the fridge to get a snack, and, uh, you weren't there. Fruit roll-up soup? Well, let's see if it's busting or not. <laughs> Sweet, spicy, and crunchy. It's busting, busting. It's so cute. Add the koalas and heavy cream. Then strain it out. Scrumptious. Koalas, smash them, add them to the ice cream. Pretty cool. Those koalas are good. Try to keep the mangoes in the blender. Perfect puree. Mint leaves, limes, extra juice, and simple syrup. And just stomp on it. Add the lime mix, add the puree, crack a cold one, pour it in, and churn. Top with the lime, garnish with the perfect quesadilla. Oil, taco seasoning, and salt. Ooh, I like that. Pepper, smash, scoop, saute, tortilla, cheese, chicken, pepper, cheese, boom, lip press. Cheesy, easy to make, and delicious. Nutmeg. <laughs> Lemon. Squeeze. <laughs> Apples. Fold. Crimp, crimp, crimp. Slice, slice, slice. Brush, brush, brush. <laughs> Ta da! Mmm, that's scrumptious. I love beans. Mmm, so good. Butter. Guava.
Ta-da! Mmm, pleasantly tropical. Oh, fork up. Hey, Linja, fork you! No, fork you! Bring in the white sugar. Boil the 300, dunk them, and plunge into ice water. Cool and crunchy. Divinamente! Ay, Dios mío! And look, bitch, it's Charlotte and all her motherfucking children in the world. Let's see if it's spooky or not. Ooh! That's the way it's done. Wrap it up. Bake at 375 for 15 minutes and add on the eyes. Tastes like hot dogs. Bake a bite. Chop it. Season with oil, parmesan, and rosemary salt. Ooh, they're perfect. They smell divine. That's pretty good. Damn right, Nick. Today we're grilling. Patrick, stop. Please don't hurt me! Mew. Throw them on the barbie, cook till they have grill more. Patrick, feta, balsamic glaze. That is excellent. The juiciness of it. Tastes as beautiful as it looks. Fuck. Basil, salt. Push it up. Pure class bruschetta over here. I'm gonna show you guys how to make a tomato sandwich. My mom used to always make- What? Tomatoes on bread. Let's see if it's bussin' or not. That's a thick sandwich. The prep was minimal and the flavor is fantastic. Bussin'. Heat to 100 and immediately temper. Dunk in the strawberry. Ooh. If you drink this, you'll look like this. First of all, you're nothing but a trashy hoe. That's so good. My first pizza. Wow! Oh my god, babe, what's wrong? You haven't touched your bacon, egg, and cheese, salt, ketchup, pepper, mayo on the roll, the Aki Way, can't forget the Bev, you already know the vibes. Are you cheating on me? Dog water. Dumb spicy hot pot. Soy sauce, maybe? Spicy. <laughs> sea tier. Beer chips. Looks like a classic Lay's. Definitely tastes like a beer. Reminds me of college. B tier. Spicy crawfish. <laughs> smells like a Chinese grocery store. Or does it taste like B tier. Wheat basil. I guess it smells like basil. Tastes like a very bland potato chip. Boring. Sea tier. Roasted garlic oyster. The big kahuna. Baby kahuna. Garlic. Good garlic potato chip. First A tier. Oh, right next to the post. Pickle. The 
that's oddly satisfying. We're slicing the pickle chips. Don't do that without the gloves. Ta-da! Prepping the pickle juice. Add the vinegar, sugar, salt, mustard, coriander, and dill seeds. And two cups of hot water. I'm grabbing garlic. And chop up our dill. And lastly, the pickles. This will be mine. It's our secret. You're supposed to let it sit in the refrigerator overnight, but I'm too impatient, so I'm gonna vacuum seal mine. Ta da! Good theory. It's definitely infused with the pickle taste. Unboxing with Grandma. I think this might be a sword. My Sasuke costume is complete. Ooh. Encrusted with cheese. Voila! Here we go! <laughs> Amazing sweatshirt. Handle with care. Hey! Carolina Reaper and garlic. Are you gonna try it? No. It looks a little hot for me. Spicy cheese balls! Oh, good! Cheese graters! Let's test it. She's great and you know you gotta share. Dog approved. This is the last box, but it's a heavy one. Box full of knives. Now that's a cleaver. Woo! I can't wait to use it on Furman. Nobody's gonna know. They're gonna know. That works. I got my garlic here. I'm trying to get as much garlic juice. Woo! How exciting is that? <laughs> Pretty cool. The minute I found out y'all were making cookies in there prior. So it's a mega cookie. Look, Valentine's. Absolutely. Looks good. Looks perfect. Look how gooey. And now I have 20 more. Delicious. Do y'all just eat Oreos raw? Like y'all don't heat them up? Never tried that before. The milk taste. Mmm. Oh, that's really good. That's amazing. What's the best way to mash potatoes? First, peel, chop, and boil. They look perfect. Level one, the fork. My forearm is starting to hurt. Do the hell Fully mashed. It's quite long. Level two, baseball bat. I feel like I'm churning butter. They're smashed pretty good. It did a little better than the fork, much to my surprise. Level three, potato squisher. Looks like instant ramen. It's an ingenious device. Linja approved. Level four, hen mixer. <laughs> Definitely the messiest method. Very chunky. I'm very disappointed. Buttercream salt mix. Creamy, velvety, delicious. The potato smasher is the clear victor. Make your pan go from this to this. Method one, baking soda, vinegar. Bread it around, wait 20 minutes, and scrub with steel wool. Surprised me how good it was. Hack! Method two, mix baking soda and vinegar. It should be pasty. Apply to the pan, squeeze on the lemon juice, and scrub. That's it. Whack! Method three. 
Barkeeper's friend. Mix with water. Apply, spread, and scrub. That's a hack. Method one, two, three. Oh my god! It's like a big tasty sausage. Ta -da! Take out the seeds and bake it 400 for 25 minutes. Grieve out the squash, add to a blender with milk and spices. Has a little too much power. And heat it till it starts bubbling. Finally, add in the pasta and cheeses. That's what good pasta sounds like. It's nice and creamy and the squash is subtle. Amazing. Give it Charlie. Oh. Holy one. Flour, salt, sugar, water, yeast. It looks funny. <laughs> Dip in the dough. A rolling panko. Heat to 350. Ooh, nice and crispy. Top with sugar, ketchup, and mustard. Crunchy, creamy, hot doggy, delicious. Real cheese, level one. It met my low expectations, yes. Yes, yes! Level two. Ah. We're getting there. Level three. The taste of the bread, the mix of the cheeses. Mm. This one's for me. Sorry, you can't have it. You either, Charlie. The f did I do? Roasted fish flavor? Like flounder. It's got a little pizzazz. An eight out of ten. Cam Crab Ross. Looks like a smorgasbord. <coughs> it smells like potatoes. Old potatoes. A little sweet. Tomatoes? Peanuts? Mm. Eight and a half. Fried crab. It's got a little of that crab flavor, but I don't like the crab flavor. What do you think? I like the crab flavor. You want berries and cream? I'm cookies? What am I, a little lad? A little yolk? Mix faster, Linda! What? What? peek a -boo. Freeze dried, you got it? Mix it! Half of each dough, combine those joints. Scoop. Mmm. Maybe I am a little lad. Got a big one. It's huge. Fried chicken, crunchy, juicy, delicious. Buttermilk, chicken, pickle juice. Nothing like green milk. And let's sit for 30 minutes. Flour, potato starch, corn starch, paprika, and salt. Then add in all the dry ingredients. Mix faster, Linda! Fry my fast, little Linda! Completely coat the chicken and fry at 375 until golden black. If I was a fish, I'd be dead. Level one toast. Ah! Boring. Yes! Yes! Level two. Okay. I'm so proud of my butter. Here's the secret. And cinnamon. That's better. Level three. Perfect avocado. Mmm. So good. 
I've been told by way too many people that making avocado toast on these little hash brown patties from Trader Joe's was gonna change my life, so. Let's see if it's bussin' or not. Ooh. Excellent. Avocados from Mexico. Hot honey, salt, lemons. Parmesan. That's unequivocally bussin'. RV chicken legs. Season it with Traeger rub, throw them in the bag. A lot of chicken. Add oil and mush it all around. She's smoking. Grill for one hour at 180. Smells good. Then flip the legs and grill at 350 until golden brown. Time to take them off the grill. They're gonna be so delicious. Mmm, the skin is nice and crispy. Very tasty. Hey, da, I'm Sakura. Ah! Water Dragon Jutsu! Summoning Jutsu! Scallion! Shadow Clone Jutsu! How am I still doing D rank missions? Grab a kunai. Make a divot, fill with tuna, shape it. Nice. Kiwi, rice, sesame seed, extra tuna, a single scallion. Perfection. This onigiri is the best. Believe it. Does chai tea bring you glee? Ginger, mince it, yeet it. Cardamom, crack out the flavors. Chuck in the ginger, cardamom, Earl Grey tea, and let it steep for three minutes. This is so boring. Cool this, baby. You want to break it? Now serve the tea with milk, simple serve, and ice cubes. It's good. This one's really good. RV lobster roll. Crack open the lobster tails. You slap them on the Traeger at 450 and grill for 25 minutes. Melt two sticks of butter, season with parsley, osmo salt, and Old Bay. What's better than butter? Here, open the rolls and toast them in butter. When it's bubbling, you know it's ready. And cook till golden. Perfect lobster. Mm. Butter up the meat and then stuff the roll. Top with parsley. Delicious. Oh, jiggly. It's a sweet tart. Ooh. Ring freeze. It's like a boomba. Very cool. Add the frozen coffee. Make homemade whipped cream. And top with crushed cookies. Delicious. Nothing goes to waste. Cereal? Ice cream. Rooney Pebbles. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Crispy colors. <laughs> Cereal milk, sugar, milk powder, corn syrup. Ah! Scoop. Nice. That's part of a healthy breakfast. <laughs> Two cups of sugar, one cup of water, bring to a boil. All right, I'm trying this for my first time. I'm gonna, oh, take two. Oh, <laughs> I'm telling you. Cheers. Mm, I could eat 2,000 of these. It's me, the grilling grandma. Give me the lamp chop, Charlie! <laughs> Season with Linda's secret rub. Rocks in sport mode. Preheat the grill to 350. And cook for three minutes on each side. Serve with rosemary and charmoula. 
So tender. And the sauce is really good. That's why they call me the Grilling Grandma. There's only one correct way to eat a cupcake. The cupcake sandwich. No! Happy Valentine's Day! Put it in the oven at 400 for 30 minutes. Mozzarella! Bang, baby! That's the best garlic bread. We're making a super salad. You invited me over for a salad? Kobe. You're a step. I've just been dying to use this. Such a great invention. What, you just go in the pool? Uneven is perfect. Get in there. And then shred it like Sean White. Come here and add my secret salad dressing. Could you salt a sandwich, chicken palm in between them? Cutting out the salad part. But overall, not bad, Linda. <laughs> Thanks, Daddy. Got your room. Spread it, chop it. Damn, Daniel, so tasty. Melt the butter, add in the marshmallows, and mix. It's done when it's ooey and gooey. What do you mean by that? It's a little difficult, especially when you're lightweight like me. Lightweight, hey, baby. Mix till it's super sticky. What do you mean by that? Let cool for 20 minutes and slice. Mm, they look perfect. Mm, that's very good. How the am I gonna clean this? You want a pumpkin spice latte? Under one condition. It's gotta be a funky pumpkin. Oh. <laughs> that's what good pumpkin sounds like. A nutmeg, cinnamon, ginger, sugar, pumpkin. I'm in the vortex. Whoa. Perfect fall drink. You guys want pumpkin pie? Fine, I'll make a pumpkin pie. Quick start, nutmeg, cinnamon, Up with a whipped cream. That's good pumpkin pie. Perfect. Come on, you stupid thing. Gosh darn it. Creamy and delicious. Bam! Looking good. It's actually pretty good. Grab a spoon and spoon out the watermelon. Get out of here, Charlie. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs>
hollow out the watermelon, but keep the juice. Reminds me of my childhood. Add your watermelon, your fruit cocktail, and spray. Garnish with mint. A little impractical, but beautiful. Snowman milkshake. Fluff it up, pour it in, and mix till thick. Buttons, buttons, buttons. Add the stick arm, the bow tie, fill her up, top with whipped cream, and add a face. Ooh, his head got the flame. Does the pink drink stink? Dragon fruit powder. Mango, mango. Coconut milk. <laughs> We're matching. Dragon fruit. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> Dreamy. Mmm. Get out of there, Charlie. Mmm, so good. It's me, the grilling grandma. Pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, paprika, applewood salt, season, crocs, pork mode. Mm -hmm. Cook at 250 for three hours. Keep that thing on me. Spray with apple cider vinegar. And keep it juicy, juicy. It's at 135. Perfect. That's why they call me the grilling grandma. I got the honey. I was showing you what not to do. That's bombastic. Does anybody else's dog eat like this? Uno, dos, bing bong. Bread, spicy mayo, spread it, cutlets, provolone, tortured, onion, tomato, arugula, tubular, ice cream sandwich. I'll give you a f knuckle sandwich. Peekaboo. Ice cream, bread, flaky salt. This is legit. Perfect. Do I respect farmers? I've been growing this strawberry plant for a while. And I can't believe that this is all I've got. You versus the guy that she tells you not to worry about. <laughs> Super Bowl sliders. Offensive foul, not enough butter in the sauce. And the kick is good. It's a flavor touchdown. Kool-Aid soaked pickles. Don't mind if I do. And a little sugar. A few moments later. Oh, sorry. I feel it's a little disgusting looking, but I think it's gonna be a hit. Looks like a tongue. I don't like it. What a waste of good pickles. Grab a knife, pour the strawberry. Ooh. Heat to 300. Nice and shiny. Cheers. Cheers. Chick, chick, chick. Stir it up. Pour 
more on the hot sauce? Bake that sucker. Es muy caliente. Super salad! Pocky banana ice cream. <laughs> Feels good to get some anger out. I'm going bananas over this. Where has this been all my life? It smells so good. Chili powder, Big Daddy Osmo salt, Cotilla cheese, scrumptious, delicious. RV sushi, sticky rice. Slap it in the microwave. Let's just place it in there. I forgot the salmon. Now we shape the sushi and top it with our salmon. It's pretty good for so little work. What a place to be eating sushi. Get in my belly. Garlic. Yes. <laughs> oh, spaghetti. Perfection. Melt that, John. <laughs> it's a little chunky like Charlie. Spaghetti. Alfredo. Chives. Heavenly. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Happy New Year! Ten, nine, eight, seven, Delicious. This is National Wear Blue Day, and I just want to raise awareness about human trafficking. Mmm. Mangoes, lime juice, honey, salt, and water. Really good. You want me to make my favorite snack? My favorite color. This is the only way to eat it. Octopus weenie. Look at them go. It's so cute. Let's see how they taste. Nuke it, dunk it, and that's easy peasy sushi. Looks good. That's bobastic. Mmm. Sugar? Water? Oh, yeah, puppy. I think it enhances a normal peanut butter cup. You want St. Patrick's Day cookies? Fine.
Ta da! Happy St. Patrick's Day! Sweet potato! Drizzle on the glaze. Mm.